Abs. All I want is to get this campaign launched, to go home and eat my body weight and mince pies, that's it. Good. No more mucking about. It's gonna be looking for mistakes. No. I have someone to sap when it all goes tits up. <sighs> Thanks. I do remember what happened to Brian. God rest his soul. Exactly. So I'm giving this one 110% abs, no more distractions. There are gonna be a million people out there freezing and they're the only ones I'm concentrating on. Really? So you're not looking out for yourself at all? No. Yeah, all this good work you're doing, it's completely selfless. Yep. Because you're such a good, virtuous person. Again? Yep. Uh, I'm not sure the evidence supports you, Nick. <laughs> I think it does. The four years I've been here, a year before that volunteering at the DEC, I've done chugging on the streets and three 10k runs for Parkinson's. Stunning. And no offence, but that slightly trumps wearing hemp shoes and using eco washing up liquid. Uh, that is totally unfair. No. I volunteered for a year in Ghana. Uh, I, I help out that hospice in Hepton. I'm, I'm running that half marathon in June for infant cancer. And I've got a direct debit for Greenpeace. How much for? £10 a month. 15 for amnesty. Yeah, well done you. you know, not all of us are moneyed. <laughs> Meaning what, please? Well, maybe my generosity comes more from in here. Ah, oh, so you're, you're what, more genuine? Being working class means I'm more down to earth. Working class? How are you working class? Because I say class. That doesn't make you working class. Yeah, well, in my house it does. You live in Crouch End, you read The Guardian, and you eat Dorset cereal. I meant my family. Mm, which is where, please? In Cardiff, which you know. Oh, where your dad is, a eh? Doctor, so? And you live in a five-bedroom house. Well, at least I'm not from some soulless commuter town. Hey, Reading is not soulless, eh? It's got the Oracle Shopping Centre and Greenhouse. Access to the M4. Exactly. <sighs> so, what's not genuinely good about me then? This cheeky, chappy Jamie Oliver thing. Is that genuine, Nick? And this lumberjack shirt you're wearing? It's reflecting your heritage. Lumbering. Um, I don't really get what you're trying to say. Okay, answer me this, Nick. Are you genuinely in this job because you want to help people? Yes. And not just because you like interfering? No. I'm totally straight up. Totally. See, as far as anyone else is concerned, I'm motherfucking Teresa.